In this video, I'm going to show you how you can download a series of waypoints on the Willamette River water trail, um, import them into Google Earth Pro, and then uh, view them on your computer. So the first thing that you need to do is download Google Earth Pro. It's a free program. I don't think I need to show you how to download that, but just type in Google Earth Pro uh, and then download the appropriate version. The next thing you need to do is to install Google Earth Pro on the computer. Uh, after you've done that, let's go ahead and open it up. Here it is. Um, the next thing that you need to do is to download the KLM file, uh, excuse me, the KMZ file that contains the waypoints. And I've put that on my website. So you'll find that um, at www.fullbean.com slash kayak slash charts slash Willamette hyphen river dot KMZ and everything in that URL was in lowercase. So let's go ahead and do that. You can see that it's been downloaded here. Um, I suggest that you download it to the downloads folder. That's where mine is downloaded automatically. But you can click it and click show in, in folder and it'll show you where it's located. So the next thing you need to do is to, once it's downloaded, go back to Google Earth uh, Pro, click on File, and then click on Import, and then tell it what to import. And you want to import the file you just downloaded. So you need to navigate to wherever you put it. If you don't see it listed, click on all files and then it will find it. Click on that and it will be uh, installed in your temporary directory. In order to be able to get to it, you need to see the uh, side panel. So click on view and then put a check in sidebar. And you can see here that it's in temporary places, the Willamette River. Uh, if you expand that, you'll see um, all of the locations along the Willamette River. Uh, where this user has uh, made comments. So click on any one of them. Uh, and it will zoom in to that area. If that's too detailed for you to realize where it is, you can 
scroll back out or you can scroll the other way. Um, there's lots of useful information there. Uh, one thing you're probably going to want to do, though, if you find this interesting, is to move the file from out of the temporary places and put them in my places. Um, so the way you do that is you left click uh, Willamette River and then you move it up to my places and let it go. And then it'll be in the Willamette River. Before you close Google Earth Pro, you want to go File and then Save and Save My Places. Now the next time that you open Google Earth Pro up, it will be as you left it today. Uh, give it a try. I hope you find it useful.